Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. It is a brand new day and a brand new race coming up. It is the A-Line ARDH downhill race. This is on one of the most popular trails in the world, one of the most well-known trails in the world, A-Line. It's basically a series of a ton of jumps, a ton of berms, and today is wet. So it's gonna be, from guessing, or my assumptions, very, very sketchy. We'll see how it goes. Excited for this one. Make sure you drop a like in the video before we get stuck into it and uh, Let's get this one underway, I'm excited for it. There we go. Right. God, it's wet. So, dropping in for A-line practice. It is soaking wet and really sketchy. God. I don't know like what to trust. Oh. So muddy. Don't know where the grip is. Ah! I have no idea where the grip is in these corners. It's so slippy. Really hard packing in. Then not so hard pack. I'm not even running a mud guard. Rookie error. Feel the hard pack bits and the holes are soft. Super hard to predict. Oh, that's my wheel. Oh my god, they're so sharp. Yeah, just hard to see, yeah. hard to predict what's slippy and what's not. <laughs> yeah. Back in. A lot of the jumps are very kicky this year. Ooh. Like this corner looks super slippy. Man, I can ba barely see it's so wet. Back in into the lower wooded section now. A bit slippy in here, always.
Yeah. Pretty good, yourself? Good. Back in. Pretty puddly. Oh. Whoa. Ah! Still slippy the berms though. Tired from squashing everything. <laughs> you go off the big one or the little one? Huh? I'm off the little one just like pushed across. Inside. a little bit better These berms are insanely huge. Well, second lap in. I think I got that, uh, them a bit better, which is good. Whoa, really slick. A little pedally bit. Moon is a bit slippy on the takeoff. <clears throat> High speed. Back into A line lower. Squash. Technical section here. So I just got done with two practice runs so far, first one was a bit rusty, second one a little bit better, just getting into the swing of things like squashing the jumps, it's uh, really really difficult to do at speed and then obviously the mud is, as well on top is really rough and uh, tough to predict but uh, yeah feeling alright, I am going up for another one and then I'm first rider dropping in for pro men. Wait, Josh Lewis. Alright, we're going back in. 
So the real hard bit is trusting the berms. It's kind of no problem on this bike. Oh, overshot that. So dark. Ah! Couldn't see a thing. Nah. So sketchy. Tinted lines like do not help at all. But. Nah. Slippy berms. Ah. It's raining down here again. This weather is so nuts. Just as it was drying out. Uh, so I've done three practice runs. It's going to be sketchy in the race. I'm first rider down in the lead, so I'm going to go home and uh, get kind of cleaned up but A-line race, A-line air DH in the rain, how gnarly. You could, you could drive up mountain road probably quite fast. The YouTube stuff by the way. Thank you very much, right. appreciate it. Have fun. Thanks dudes.
434.7. That's a fast, fast time, Derek. Holy, 434. Holy. We are in store for a tumbling clock here, I think, as Lou Buchanan, very close to the fastest time we've seen all day in the score Air DH, and that is the first of the pro men. Time oh, to run. Coming, Mick Hanna, last year's champion. Is it going to take her now? Oh, Mick Hanna by four tenths of a second behind Blakey. Oh, we just got done with the Air DH. That was probably one of the most fun races that I've done in a long time. I had a really good time. Uh, I opted for the big rig for the downhill bike, as you can see here. And the conditions looked like that. But yeah, full downhill setup for this one. The only change I did was I put 130 PSI in my fork, so I stiffened up the fork a bit. I up my tire pressure by a couple PSI, but nothing crazy. I'm not sure where I finished. I, at the, off the top of my head, I think I was around about mid 20s, which is really good in pro men. I'm actually really happy with that. Uh, I'll confirm in the corner somewhere the final result. But all these guys that were in front of me were, I was either pretty damn close to them and they're insane bike riders and do this stuff a lot. And then the top guys, like, I was like 13 seconds, 14 seconds off the win, which is a lot. Uh, but when you look at what they do and their training and how they ride the track and like race and full time training and all that sort of stuff. Uh, I can't be too annoyed at myself, so I'm I'm proud of what I did. Like looking back at my run, um, I wish I'd maybe attacked a little bit more, pedaled a little bit harder. Um, but this is all this sort of thing that motivates me to like maybe train this winter, come back and do the race next year and see how I get on, see if I do any better. Um, so it's all kind of good things. But other than that, happy boy. Yeah, like the bike worked really well in the corners, the rough stuff. My rebound's still a little bit too fast, so I, I think I need to get that stuff back to JTEC and get them to maybe slow down a click or two. Um, but yeah, what a race, uh, Sam Blank in top one, Mick Hanna second, third place, I'm not too sure who was third, but sick race, A-line in the wet is sketchy as, shout out to um, the crowd that came out to watch in the rain, it wasn't nice, but had a good time, but yeah, that's it for now, slap a like on the video, always helps the channel out, comment below, and subscribe to the channel so you stay tuned for future videos, thanks for watching, peace out y'all.